poprzednim odcinku gry o tron. It's only blood. It's only blood. It's only blood. It's only blood. Witam wszystkich bardzo serdecznie, ja jestem Piechol, kontynuujemy Iron from Ice. Czyli żelazo z lodu, tak w sumie. Nie, Iron to jest na pewno żelazo? A tymczasem relacje Itana z siostrą. No wiesz, jaki obowiązek na nim ciążył? On miał zostać lordem po swoim ojcu. Prawie do dziedziczenia był pierwszy w kolejce. Ale będzie musiał dorosnąć do roli nowej, która została mu nadana. I don't want to change, I may have to change. I may have to change a little bit. I'd rather have my brother than a lord. I'll have to have both, I'm afraid. No dokładnie. Będziesz musiał być dobrym lordem, dobrym bratem. Since you're the new lord, you can do anything you want. I suppose. Everyone will have to do as you say. So I can have all the sweets I want. <laughs> Jaki dzieciak. It would be nice if. To nie działa w ten sposób, maleńki. Niestety. Ethan will be a good lord. Żebym się nażar słodyczy. That's not how it works. Well, that's how it should work. You are the Lord. Tak, ale Lord musi być dobry, sprawiedliwy. A nie kurze wszystkie słodycze dla siebie zabierać. No inne dzieci też chcą. Okej, kto to wołał? Słyszałem inny głos, ale nie widziałem twarzy. What's the matter? Lord Whitehill has arrived, unannounced and certainly unexpected. He's come demanding justice. No okej, okay, czyli trzeba będzie go kulturalnie poinformować, że Garet odjechał. Nie no, oczywiście, że tak. Kurde, trzeba iść. No trzeba zachować się jak Lord, no sorry, kurde. Dzieciństwo Itana się skończyło w momencie, jak zabito jego ojca i starszego brata. O, jacy zasmuceni. No ale w sumie chyba dzieje się to, czego ta dziewczynka nie chciała, czyli że Gareth się zmienia. No ale musi, kurde, musi po prostu. Okay, kto ma więcej żołnierzy w tej sali? They showed up unannounced. Lord Whitehill is in a lather. I assume you explained to Lord Ethan why they're here. A business with Garrett. I told him. Lord Whitehill knows Garrett is a squire to this house. Or was, I suppose. Is, was. It makes no difference. The Whitehills were clearly in the wrong. So don't give him any satisfaction. Dokładnie, tak trzeba będzie zrobić. Lubię, lubię Roylanda. Again with these bastards. Let's not do something rash. Things are bad enough as it is. I can handle this. Hey, look, we'll show them that we're here. No, seriously. Well said, my lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men and the backing of House Bolton. No, look, we'll show them that we're here. No, seriously. Well said, my lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men and the backing of House Bolton. No, look, we'll show them that we're here. No, seriously. Well said, my lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men and the backing of House Bolton. No, look, we'll show them that we're here. No, seriously. Well said, my lord. Nie wygląda jakoś strasznie źle. Lord Ethan, is it? My condolences for your father and brother. The late Lord Forrester was no friend to me or my house. Shake his hand. Kultura wymaga. My only regret is I wasn't there to drive the dagger into his heart myself. O takim typem człowieka jest. Dobra. The foresters finally get their due. He died a hero. My father died a hero, fighting for the north against traitors and oathbreakers. Aye, and look where that got him. And no bread and salt. 
Ma trochę racji. No dobra, idźcie po ten chleb i sól. Fetch Lord Whitehill some bread and salt. It was an oversight, Lord Whitehill. I promise it won't happen again. Not likely. You foresters have shit on us for generations. Well, now the Starks are no longer around to have your back, are they? We're the power in the North now. Roose Bolton is the Warden of the North. Aye, and we've been his bannermen for five fucking centuries. You. No, dobra. Układ e, sił się troszeczkę zmienił faktycznie. You're losing control of this. We all serve House Bolton now. I'm not finished. Maybe if you hadn't been so fucking greedy with the ironwood, things would have been different between us. You squandered your share. Our share was taken from us. We had no fucking choice but to harvest what was left. What is it you want, Lord Whitehill? No, dokładnie. Czego kurde chcesz, koleś? Przejeżdżasz niezapowiedziano. A ten frajerek, kurde. Czyli chodzi o Gareda. Wybitnie. Your man, the squire. We were minding our own business, keeping the king's peace, as his lordship here said, when your man attacked us for no reason. Hear that? Attacked for no reason. You murdered his family. You murdered his family. Then you admit it was your man who killed my men, and a pig farmer at that. How do you answer for your squire, Lord Ethan? He acted in your name, and you are the. And how do you answer for we your men? We lost people too, Lord Whitehill. Your men murdered his entire family. You lost pig farmers, not soldiers. The soldiers worth a hundred of their type. Chyba dla ciebie to jest taki przelicznik tylko. My men. I know he's here. What have you done with him? Zajęłem się tym. Took care of it. He received his punishment, and it's done. He's gone. What? Gone? That was my justice to deliver, boy, and you denied me of it. I'm not leaving until I have my justice. Serialu. Ja Roose Bolton. What kind of fucking house is this? A house of honourable men. Oh, zgasson. Lady Forrester. You bellow like a wounded boar, Lord Whitehill. Have you forgotten your manners? I mean no disrespect to you, my lady, considering your losses and all. But this, this is not over. A zupełnie inne podejście do synka i do matki. Dziękujemy za przybycie. A dobra, kid, dobijmy go. Lord Whitehill. Ethan is Lord of Ironrath now. By rights, his word is law here. If that displeases you, then I trust you can find the door. No, wydaje mi się, że matka tutaj naprawdę pomaga okrutnie. But Lord Bolton will have the final say. I'll send him a raven letting him know a forester man killed one of his own. That the new Lord Forester lied to my face and denied me my justice. Then we'll see whose word is law. You're a craven. Do as you like. We're in the right. No tak, my mamy rację, no. Remember that. A ten głosi, kurde, ten głosi. He will. No jasne. Jasne, że to zapamiętam. No chyba się wszyscy obudzimy ze sztyletami w plecach, panowie. Your son did well, my lady. He kept his wits while Lord Whitehill lost his temper. A lesser man would have been rattled. But Ethan here held his ground. You were brave, my son. No był zdeterminowany. Musiał dać radę. Prepare a raven. We need to send word to Mira in King's Landing at once. Hey, czy czy byśmy wreszcie mieli poznać Mirę? Posłyszałem też, że akcja się rozgrywa w King's Landing, w królewskiej przystani. Tam gdzie Lannisterowie siedzą i królowie. Ale jak ona ma pomóc stamtąd? She has Marjorie Tyrell's favor, and Lady Marjorie's betrothal to the king may be enough to keep the Boltons at bay, if it's presented to her as it should be. O, z Lady Marjorie z chęcią porozmawiam. Tylko nie wiedziałem, że ktoś od Foresterów jest w bezpośredniej bliskości z samą królową. O, a właśnie, ona już teraz jest z e, tym małym, którego nikt nie lubi. Kurczę. Już nie żyje i zapomniałem jego imienia. Nie, 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 moment, moment, moment. 
blondynek, mały, na tronie. E, dostawał często liście od Tyriona. A, 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 nie przypomnę sobie, ale dziura w mózgu. Nie, dobra, oglądaj książkę, może mi się przypomni w trakcie. Ah. Joffrey! Dokładnie, Joffrey. Choć nie wiem, jak ta książka mi przypomniała. Raczej nie. <grym> Raczej w ogóle nie pomogła, no ale... Czyli ona jest pewnie teraz jeszcze w tej fazie zaręczenia z Joffreyem. Jeszcze jest przed fioletowym weselem. Tym, gdzie Joffrey został otruty. No sorry, nie burzcie się na spoilery, ale mówiłem, że będą. A to są akurat konkretnie spoilery czwartego sezonu Gry o Tron. Mmm, no dobra, rozglądajmy się wszędzie. Garedem podniosłem jakieś przedmioty i kurczę, póki co się nie przydały, ale tutaj będziemy pewnie lawirować między miejscami. Dobra, bierz siano. Asher, brat na wygnaniu, tak? Moment, czy to przypadkiem nie była ta moneta, którą Arya Stark pokazała żeglarzowi na końcu sezonu? Uuu. Valar Mogulis. Czy jakoś tak? Dobra, przeczytajmy, po co tylko oglądać. Father. Much excitement here in King's Landing for the coming wedding. Lady Marjorie has proven to be quite popular throughout the city. A, czy jest przed wesel. Dobrze. Mother could come. Although I know it would be impossible under the circumstances. I miss all of you and I look forward to the day you can. A, to jest pewnie list, który miała wysłać i nie zdążyła, bo Tatuś umarł. Przykre. Ethan made this for me. I przysłał kurierem. Doczepili do czterech wron, czy tam do czterech kruków, bo nie wiem, co tu wysyłają tak właściwie. Doczepili im na linkach paczuszkę i proszę bardzo. A, I co tu jeszcze? Zwykła moneta? To było bardzo kind of Lady Marjorie, to give this to me. It once belonged to Lady Elena. Uuu. No, 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 czyli jest w dobrych stosunkach z przyszłą królową. Dobrze, to się przysłuży. To będzie bardzo pomocne. Dobra. Cole Brazier. Czyli co, podgrzewasz na węgiel? Wow. Ej, nie, ale sobie widzicie to, roz widzicie to rozmycie tutaj? To tak powinno być? To miało, być, to miało nadać jakiegoś artyzmu? Tak samo tu, no spójrzcie tu miskę i na ławeczkę, no co jest grane? Coś się kurde nie wczytało? No dobra, tu jeszcze jedna karteczka, to za chwilę, a może już od razu. Pewnie jak przejrzę wszystko, to ktoś tu przyjdzie. Czyli pertraktuj, maleńka. Baw się w politykę. No wiedziałem, kurde, że ktoś przyjdzie. Nie zdążyłem spojrzeć przez okno. Już chyba nie zdążę. A, dobra, otwieramy, jeżeli ktoś tam faktycznie stoi. Tylko któż to może być? Kurde, mogłem kufer zamknąć. Sorry, lady. I didn't mean to disturb you. I can come back later if you'd like. Puszczamy takiego Obdartusa? Pewnie, że tak. Miał smutną minę. Ale... Kurczę, te oczy... To spojrzenie... No, coś może zbroić. Tylko co on tak właściwie robi? A, donosi węgiel. Martwię się po prostu. Szybciej ten węgiel dokładaj, no. Dwie kostki na raz, a nie po jednej. No dokładnie. I'm her handmaiden. I'm her handmaiden. That's what I thought. I've seen you with her before. You seem like good friends. I saw Lady Marjorie outside the royal sept, talking to Queen Cersei. Cersei. 
Nie mu się żyją poznam. Cersei. A, najmniej lubiana postać żeńska. Dlaczego mi to mówisz? Kurde, no przecież nie zdąż... No, wcisnąłem dobrze. I heard them arguing about House Forrester. House Forrester? Oh oh. I dom już był przedmiotem rozmowy. Forgive me if I was mistaken. I hope you're not in any kind of trouble. Most people don't tend to notice a cold boy, not in King's Landing with so many lords and ladies about. You see and hear all sorts of things when people don't even know you're there. Huh. Jestem ciekaw, czy bym coś odpowiedział, to bym dowiedział się więcej. To trochę mało, ale w sumie zawsze coś. Przydatna informacja. Są mi cyckie, Lady Marjorie, nie znaczy się. I was hoping there would be time for us to talk. Come, there's something we must discuss. Ej, ale to jest ta aktorka, dokładnie ta aktorka z serialu podkłada głos. Łe, to świetnie, czyli możemy się tutaj Petera Dinklage'a spodziewać, jak poznamy Triona. From the day you arrived in Highgarden, I thought of you more as a friend than as my handmaiden. A dear friend, in fact. Thank you, my lady. And you know how I feel about what's happened to your family. I feel your pain as if it were my own. Czyli będziesz chciała mi pomóc. What you've suffered is beyond imagining. You're very kind. I need your help. I need your help, my lady. No, dokładnie. Of course. And I will help you in any way I can. But there's another matter we must attend to first. You must understand there are limits to what I can say, especially here in King's Landing, now that I am to be queen. To have a handmaiden from the North whose family fought for Rob Stark. It raises questions at a time I can least afford. Aha, czyli tą też odeślą gdzieś? ...cornered me this morning outside the Royal Sept. She mentioned the northern girl in my service, and she painted you a traitor. Oh, you're just zdrada. Wow. Why would she do that? No, chciałbym poznać motywy. What does she intend to do? She intends to make you miserable, knowing that will make me miserable as well. She demands an audience. She wants an apology of some sort for what I don't know, but. She's waiting for us now, and I promised I would bring you to her. I wouldn't ask this of you if it were not important. I cannot afford any conflict with Cersei with the wedding. No, I'll do it like you do, my lady. I knew I could trust you. Humor her. Tell her what she wants to hear. No, it depends on what it will be. But I can go on some errors. The agent is ready to receive us. Zwłaszcza, że królowa regentka jest za nas z tego, że lubi zabijać skrycie. Lub czasami bardzo otwarcie wręcz. You'll be fine. I know you will. You may feel one thing, but you must say another. Mogę wejść? No, ja myślałem, że kurczę, no powie, że Królowa regentka oczekuje, albo coś w tym stylu, a nie, że poszła zaanonsować zwykłą służkę. Chyba, że Lady Marjorie też wchodzi i będzie dodatkowo pomagać. Ale w sumie czemu by miało to nie być? Ej, jest i Tyrion! Siema! Oby był przyjacielsko nastawiony. Dobra, idziemy, spokojnie, pewnie, pewnie. Pokazuj, że masz jaja, chociaż jesteś kobietą. No ale też trzeba będzie kombinować. Aha. Ten on ma wielki łeb. Ale żeby podkładał głos lepiej niż w Destiny, bo w Destiny troszeczkę mu nie wyszło. With your permission, allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Już mam klękać. Bow your head. I am honored, your grace. Yet not honored enough to kneel, I see. House Forrester is a northern house loyal to the king. Are they? I beg your pardon, your grace. I wasn't talking to you. I want to hear from the girl. Ta już się rządzi, no nie wierzę, no. Is he loyal to the king? Tak, oczywiście. The new Lord Forrester. He's not here, is he? 
She is. House Forester's loyalty to the Crown never wavers, Your Grace. I see. And yet. For centuries, the Foresters have been loyal bannermen to House Stark. A house of traitors. Dobra, co nas mają? They were our wardens. We all served at the pleasure of the king. Clever girl. To spojrzenie. The girl did say the loyalty was unwavering. She has a talent for equivocation, yet I question what she really thinks. Is your house willing to swear fealty to your new liege lord, Roos Bolton? Ah, tak. On też służył Starkom, to prawda. And proved his loyalty to the crown by bringing their house to a swift and sudden end. Old allegiances are not easily abandoned, but now that the war is over, we must look to rebuild and forge new alliances. There are ships and shields to be built, and Joffrey will need a steady supply of ironwood for his armies. I'm told there are others who would happily serve that purpose, but I trust we can rely on House Forester. Pewnie, że tak. Ironwood does seem rather unique. Yes, Your Grace, yes, po prostu. Grace. It would be a shame to see it fall into the hands of another house. I imagine you'd do almost anything to prevent that from happening, wouldn't you? Ask any Lannister, and they do whatever was necessary to save Casterly Rock. It would be unfortunate to see another house attain to what's yours. Ah. There are limits, Your Grace. Perhaps, but not if your house faces potential ruin. What would you have the girl do, Cersei? It's not as if she fought beside the Starks, wielding a battle axe for the Northern Army. No. Czego sobie pani wymaga? Can we truly blame those who end up on the wrong side of the wall? Our dear Marjorie here was betrothed to Renly Baratheon on the false assumption that he would one day rule the Seven Kingdoms. Can we fault her for her mistake? Should she be held accountable? Pewnie że nie. She only followed her heart. Ale ściemo. And the very same heart so quickly led her to my son. If there's a point to this, I hope you find it quickly. Loyalty can be such a hard thing to define. This city alone is filled with all sorts of ambitious opportunists looking to reinvent themselves. Pretending to be something they're not. Who knows what lurks within their hearts? No, tu akurat się z nią zgadza. Ludzie to dwulicowe świnie. I won't be conflicted. I tell you, yeah, I kept saying it. It's very weak, but it doesn't come out as I wanted. I have time wasted by a northern girl who thinks she can play games. Who do you choose? My king, of course. The king, of course. Well said. I was beginning to worry you didn't have your priorities straight. She is a threat to the crown, isn't she? The most dangerous handmaiden in all of King's Landing. Yeah, just said he's a little bit sarcastic. Not surprising, I suppose, for a northern girl, but not very encouraging either. I'd like a word with you, if I may. Of course, Your Grace. Oj, to spojrzenie nie było zbyt fajne. Nie, ale tak ładnie odwzorowali w sumie. Jestem ciekaw, czy Lady Marjorie będzie zadowolona. But I met your father once at the tourney at Lannisport. Even then he didn't dress Roos Bolton. We only spoke briefly, but your father struck me as an honorable man. You have my condolences for his loss. Dziękuję, Lordzie Tyrion. It's trying times for your family, even under the best of circumstances. Thank you, Lord Tyrion. That's very kind of you to say. That certainly took courage. 
to so publicly declare your loyalty to Joffrey for all to hear. Poor Lady Marjorie was humiliated, although Cersei seemed quite pleased. It was quite the first impression. I, of course, found it all highly entertaining. I did it for Lady Marjorie. Hmm, rather odd, if that's what she asked of you. But I'm sure she has your best interests at heart. My sister and I have our differences. No, raczej. Raczej bym z tobą nie gadał tak szczerze i otwarcie. We must find our amusements where we can. She threatened to give your ironwood to another house. It is the master of coin who decides such matters. The crown needs boats. Boats need wood, and I speak for the crown in this regard. Not you could help my family. You could help my family. I suppose the crown could be persuaded to secure Ironwood from House Forrester. Lady no. Marjorie might not look favorably on such an alliance, and it would infuriate Cersei. Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Are you willing to risk that? In fact, forget I even suggested. Yes, I am. It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Please. You are a brave girl, aren't you? I'll consider it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I promised Sansa I would join her for dinner tonight. Three beautiful bottles of Dornish wine await my arrival. I the hope we meet again. Makes me thirsty already. I hope we meet again. Nothing would make Cersei happier. Until then, be careful. This is not the North. King's Landing can be a nest of vipers to the uninitiated. No, próbowałem teraz troszeczkę pogrywać sobie i nie wyszło, więc no. Żeby mnie te żmije nie zjadły żywcem. No dobra, kochani, to jest chyba dobry moment, żeby zakończyć dzisiejszy odcinek z Gry o Tron. Zobaczymy, co się wydarzy w kolejnym. Delikatna zajawka, czyżby? Cersei has a way of looking at you as though you're nothing. Oh, well, let's put some more in it. Not so great. So it's time to rose more. I'm sorry. Cersei is known for being rather. Ah, well, well, let's see. To już zobaczymy w kolejnym odcinku. Co tutaj będzie dalej? Żegnam was. Trzymajcie się i do usłyszenia następnym razem. Pozdro. Cześć. Cześć.